Welcome back everyone. Um, so I've got some good news and bad news. Um, both good news and bad news I only found about today. Um, so I'll start off with the good news. Um, so the Fallout first is free until I think the 16th of this month, which is about a week-ish we have it for, um, which is good. Um, that's just loading now. Um, so it's one of the best times I'd say at the moment to start um, like getting all your scrap into your scrap boxes and doing that because I have. Um, I've cleared out my scrap boxes, um, I don't scrap, my um, normal boxes of junk, they put all this stuff in. Um, but yeah, the main thing of that is, yeah, do it now while you got the free stuff. Um, if you like me, you've got two characters, more now on another video. Um, I would definitely say, put everything into your first, um, character you have and then work on your second character if you again if you like me and you're working with a new character um but not at the moment but anyway the bad news is um and i'm not i don't know if this 100 percent confirmed i've i'm going to try and see if i can put the, a link to the um news article blog whatever want to be whatever it count as i don't know um, as it reads, I've got it up right now, it says, Say goodbye to Fallout 76's Battle Royale, which, that's sad to say, it's, it's sad to go in a lot of ways, um, but it says, it says, it says um, Nuclear Winner is about to, uh, about to end, so, sadly enough, um, Nuclear Winner is going to end. Um, I am sort of wondering in a sense why, like the, what I've read, I can't actually see why, um, there's any reason why it's ending. Um, I'll have to do a bit more research on that and maybe make a part two video, I don't know. Um, but, yeah, sadly enough it's coming in, but I would definitely say right now it's, I think it's, um, um, it's, looking through this very quickly um i think it's coming out in uh september is uh when nuclear winter seems to be it will come to an end which again sad to say, see it go because i've only just gone back in the Fallout 76 and i've been enjoying it so much um yeah anyone see my one i did about if it's um, still good to play in um, 2021, um, I again still do say yes. There's a few, so yeah, still a few hicks in there, but for all means and purposes, it's still a great mode. I still enjoy it. I'm not good with um, battle royales in a lot of ways, but I still enjoy that mode. Um, but yeah, it's. Uh, I'm just reading again. I was trying to. There's not actually a lot of information on it, but um. Well, um, one little bit is here. Um, Bethesda hasn't given up on PvP in Fallout 76 uh, entirely. Uh, blah blah blah. Um. Uh, so, uh, uh again, yeah, not really much. Um. I know, but. Oh, yeah, there's not, there's not a lot, but there is a lot. Um, I, don't, I just can't really find it. But anyway, um, yeah, like, PV or Battle Royale is, was one of the only PvP way or modes for a while. Um, you know, obviously then we had the Nuclear Winner. I uh, know Nuclear Winner, that's what I'm talking about. We had the Survival Mode. Um, game Mode. Obviously, and then we started. Well, they got rid of that. Sadly enough, I think it's as well as enough people. Um, but yeah, now they're getting rid of um, battle royale, which again, heartbreaking in a way. Not really, but yeah, if you enjoy it, like I, I still get on the battle royale at times, and you know, have a bit of muck around, play around. It's all fun. Um, 
But yeah, sadly enough, um, it's coming to an end, which, like all great things it does, um, I'm this, I'm, again, I'm still looking through as I'm, um, talking, um, I'll stay here, I am, I'm currently playing, reading, and talking, what a mixture, um, but yeah, that's mainly the whole stuff, again, I'll be putting, trying to put a link into it, in the, the either the description or as a comment, um, so if anyone wants to have a read about it, you can go have a look, um, but yeah, hopefully, if they get rid of Nuclear Winner altogether, I don't know if that means they're only going to get rid of it for a while, um, because, um, this is written, or one bit here says, um, it's also became tougher to put full Nuclear Winner lobbies together without also making sacrifices on the max waiting time, which is true. Um, anyone who's ever played Nuclear Winner knows it is a pain to get into a match. And at times, um, it'll crash, which is a pain, obviously. But, um, yeah, it's a battle royale, so I suppose it would take a while, I suppose, to load one up. But, yeah, like, it is, at times, annoying to have to wait, like, 10, 20 minutes to load into the game, and then have to wait another 5, 10 minutes, I suppose, to actually get into the game. Um, which, again, it is... I'd say it's one of the, mo the most unique battle royales I've played. Um, hopefully they replace that game mode with something. Um, I still reckon if they add a single player mode, um, it would be a lot better in a way. Um, again, that got another video here and there. Um, but you definitely have to, they really should replace it with something else because. Like, Fallout first, it's good, but, like, you can have up to, I think, six people, which includes you, so I think five other people in a personal lobby, which is not great if you're doing role-playing, um, which, um, you know, hopefully this replaces it with something, um, but that's enough rambling for me. That's pretty much the main stuff of this, is, yeah, Nuclear Winner, sadly enough, is coming to an end. Um, sad to see it go, but hopefully, um, either it gets fixed up and then brought back, or they replace that game mode with something else. Hopefully. Um, and yeah, the, currently the, Fallout First is free, this, and for like five days. Um, so, share the video around people who play Fallout 76 as well, um, or haven't been on it for a while, and, you know, just, um, so they know to come on and um, play a bit of Nuclear Winner and um, get the free flat first. But um, hope you haven't enjoyed and uh, I'll see you all in the next video.